Hello, everyone. Welcome, and we are so excited to wrap up today's event with our presentation from Vanessa Jensen from Shure. Welcome, Vanessa. Thank you so much, Jay. We're so happy to be here today. Oh, great. And we have Stephanie Fry, who's going to be managing the chat window today. So uh, as you were going through the, today's presentation, we've got a lot of awesome information to go over in our 30 minutes. Um, any questions that you may have along the way, please type those into the chat window. I'll go ahead and start a, um, a chat and we will go ahead and get started. Vanessa, please take it away. Thank you so much, Jay, and thank you everyone for being here today. Today's session is connected to the classroom, and today we're going to explore audio solutions for all educational environments. And I'd like to first extend a warm welcome to all of our attendees today, to those in higher ed and those in K through 12, welcome. I'd also like to extend a warm welcome to our friends in Canada and anyone joining from overseas. We are so happy that you took the time to be with us here today. And for those who are unfamiliar, Sure is a 95 year old company. We were founded in 1925 in Chicago, Illinois. At present day, we're sold in over 120 countries around the world. We've got 30 offices, five engineering centers, and two manufacturing facilities worldwide. Sure is truly a global organization. And that being said, for our friends that are located outside of the US, again, we do have those 30 global offices with support staff in market. But we also make all of our product materials available in a variety of languages. And with that, just a quick note about myself. I'm Vanessa. I'm so happy to have you here today. I'm responsible for market development of Sure Systems products in the Northeast US. And in my role, I work very closely with schools and universities as a resource to help provide guidance and support for technology solutions in the classroom. So let's get started. Um, high quality audio to meet the demands of education. I think we can all agree on one thing and that it's a new world, right? So from hybrid learning to touch-free to socially distanced, there are so many unique challenges facing educational facilities today. And since the beginning of the year, we've seen a lot of schools, universities, um, and colleges adding or upgrading their teaching spaces so that they could provide that streaming or distance learning capability so that students can continue to participate in, le in lectures and classes but also maintain social distancing or either move that to a fully remote platform. So today we're gonna to focus on a few things. We're gonna discuss how we can improve presentations and discussions with high quality audio to enhance that student learning experience. We will highlight some considerations that should be taken into account when designing and implementing AV systems for sound reinforcement, distance learning and lecture capture. And last, we'll discuss how we can enhance your audio experience, but also maintain those social distancing regulations. And really the impact of the coronavirus pandemic has really challenged and transformed learning practices across the world and essentially began a global experiment in remote learning. I think even as lockdowns begin to lift, it's clear how we learn will never go back to how it was before. This includes classroom spaces and how we use them. So that size and the design of classrooms will play a major role in how we mitigate the risk of spreading viruses and how students enter and occupy and use spaces. Technology will continue to play an important role in enabling new safer learning practices. So today we're actually gonna focus our discussion on four key challenges that are facing education today. And these challenges we can address directly with technology solutions. The first challenge, teaching from home. The second, hybrid learning. The third is modified classroom learning, both touch-free and socially distanced. And lastly, we'll talk about learning in non-traditional spaces. So outside of the classroom where we have to adapt and provide that learning capability. And before we get started, just a really quick peek at a couple of key installations with Sure products in education. So on the left-hand side, you'll see that MXA 710. Now that's our new linear array microphone, and that's being deployed campus-wide at the University of Southern California, along with Sure's Intellimix Room audio processing software. 
On the upper right hand corner, you'll see that MXA 910 at the University of Bedfordshire just across the pond with our friends in the UK. And on the lower right hand corner, you'll see our friends up in Quebec. They're using the um, QLXD system at McGill University. So all consistent high quality audio used to enhance that learning experience. And so with that, let's jump into that first unique challenge and that's teaching from home. You know, it's clear that in 2021, hybrid learning will continue. And what that means for teachers and professors is that they're gonna to continue to teach their students from their kitchen table, from their dining room table, or from their home office, if they're lucky to have one. All of this from their laptop, from an iPad. And often what we find is that the onboard microphone on these devices typically doesn't provide the best audio quality for lecture recording or distance learning. With products like Shure's MV5C, we can offer a simple plug and play audio upgrade. Now the MV5C connects with the included USB cables to a PC or to a Mac, and it's compatible with leading third party platforms such as Zoom or Teams. The MV5C is gonna offer better intelligibility and speech clarity, which is going to enhance that student learning experience overall. And for those of you that are attending today, really excited, we will raffle off one of these at the end of the presentation. So stay tuned and best of luck to each of you. With that, I'm gonna to move to that next challenge, which is hybrid learning. Now hybrid learning is a newer requirement for educational facilities, and we have that need to remain flexible, right? So we can support full-time remote learning as needed. Sure offers high quality audio products for successful hybrid learning. Sure's new ecosystem goes beyond just microphones to include processors and speakers providing a complete end-to-end -end audio solution. It's fully scalable and this solution is compatible with leading third-party platforms like Zoom and Teams. We have some advanced features that include remote monitoring and management with Sure System On software, as well as the ability to integrate with Dante Domain Manager. The AVISPL team can help work with you to determine your specific needs and recommend as well as install the proper system components to guarantee successful hybrid learning in your environment. So let's take a closer look at those system components. Again, Sure's ecosystem is going to include microphones, processors and loudspeakers. And we'll start with the, with the microphone, right? Sure's Microflex Advance Array microphones are available in three form factors. So we have the MXA 310 table array microphone. We offer the MXA 910 ceiling array microphone and the MXA 710 linear array microphone, which can be used on walls, ceilings and tables. Very, very versatile form factor. Let's talk a little bit about the MXA310. So the MXA310, while it may not allow for touch-free technology, it's a great solution for post-COVID collaboration. It features steerable coverage so that we can capture audio around a desk or a table. It also has an integrated auto mix channel out with some parametric EQ on board, and you can mute right at the device and you've got some LED status indicators. The MXA910 and the MXA710 are going to allow for touch-free applications. These are going to feature steerable coverage, similar to the 310, but in this case, we can really capture all of our talkers and we can make those voices super clear and reduce unwanted noise. Autofocus technology is built in and that's gonna fine tune the lobe's position in real time so that we can have consistent audio regardless of if a student leans back or stands up. And we also offer Intellimix processing on board. That's right, so we've got AEC and noise reduction on board the 910 and the 710. Speaking of processing, again, Sure's Intellimix processors are going to ensure your echo and noise-free audio and maximum speech intelligibility. Sure offers processing again on board the 910 and 710, and then in two other form factors, in a hardware form with the P300 and in a software license as the Intellimix Room audio processing software. Both are optimized for use with Sure's MXA series microphones. Now the P300 is gonna be really versatile. It's gonna offer that support for hardware-based and software-based codecs. And it also features our industry-first MuseSync with leading soft codecs such as Zoom or Teams. 
Intellimix Room is designed to run on the existing in-room soft codec PC that's running your soft codec client. This is going to integrate seamlessly with all soft codecs, and it does augment limited audio inputs on your soft codecs. So all in all, really depending on your connectivity needs and your microphone requirements, there is a sure solution for your application. And last but not least, and to really round out that audio signal chain, Sure offers the new MXN 5C network speaker for high quality speech reproduction. This integrates seamlessly with the ecosystem of networked hardware and software to provide a complete audio solution for classrooms, lecture halls, and auditoriums. All of this from one manufacturer with the ability to remotely monitor and manage your networked audio solution. So let's take a look at using these components in a hybrid learning example. So here we've got a smaller room and you'll see we've got some individuals around a table. In this case, we're using the MXA 310 table array mic and we've steered that covered so that we can pick up those individuals around the table. Those microphones are powered with PoE, so we've got them connected to a PoE switch and we can use either the P300 or Intellimix Room on a Room PC, all really depending on your connectivity needs. This supports, of course, hybrid learning and the team at AVISPL can help determine additional needs for any lecture capture or recording in this application. Now let's take a look at wireless microphones. Now wireless is an extremely important solution for communication in educational spaces. Sure offers a wide portfolio of wireless and that ranges from no compromise, mission critical digital systems to more value oriented solutions. And those key features that's gonna help determine selection are going to include the size of the room, the number of people involved, the presentation style, and the number of presenters. The AVISPL team, again, can help recommend and install a wireless solution that meets your needs based on these criteria. So for example, while a professor may work from a podium, he or she may be more likely to move about during the lecture to use a blackboard or a whiteboard or other tools. To accommodate this, a head-worn microphone is the preferred solution. So you'll see we've got the ability to scale from small to large setups. We can also support single and multi-channel setups as well. Um, very easy to use durable components um, in a variety of form factors with rechargeable batteries as an option. And let's take a look at the use of wireless in the classroom. So in this example, you'll see the teacher is using a new SLXD wireless body pack with a headset microphone for hands-free teaching. Now for the students, they can spread out in the classroom as needed. Um, and we've got an MXA 710 mounted to that front wall and that will provide coverage of the students in the first through the last row. The P300 is gonna support our hybrid learning in this environment with leading clients such as Teams or Zoom. And this will allow for students to be heard regardless of where they're seated. Students on the far end can be heard in the classroom with the MXN 5C speakers. And AVISPL can use Sure's designer for um, deployment and fine tuning the system. And System On is available to monitor and manage the, the system post installation. And of course, this can scale up as the classroom size increases. We've got that same wireless microphone for the teacher. And in this case, this is a larger classroom. So we've gone to rows of desks and we're using two of the MXA 710s mounted in the ceiling perpendicular to that front wall. Again, we have steerable coverage on board those linear arrays so we can pick up rows one through five. And in this example, just like in the last, we're using P300s and MXN 5Cs to accommodate hybrid learning. And of course, if you're interested in lecture capture applications, the AVISPL team can help determine what additional equipment is needed to accomplish that. And with that, I'm gonna to move to modified classroom learning, learning that is touch-free and socially distanced. Now we really need to talk a bit more about ceiling microphones or wall mounted microphones. These offer an invisible solution for classrooms and really do provide that consistent coverage for all participants, regardless of where they're seated. This helps create a dynamic and informal atmosphere 
where everyone can participate effortlessly without the need to interact with any technology. So we can really discreetly and automatically capture all of the voices. We've got a really flexible and scalable solution, as, as you've sort of seen, that can accommodate rooms of any size, shape, or layout. And we've got steerable coverage on board these guys, right? So we can cover talkers, make, making voices clearer and reducing unwanted noise. In addition to our microphones, of course, we've got the P300 or Intellimix room audio processing software to ensure that echo and noise-free audio and allow for maximum speech intelligibility. Furthermore, the MXN 5C network ceiling speaker is going to ensure high quality speech reproduction in the classroom. So let's take a look at how this scales. Here we've got a medium sized classroom. And in this space, we have two of the MXA 910s mounted in the ceiling which is allowing for that touch-free audio in the classroom. We've got lobes positioned so that we can pick up the teacher in the front of the room and the students in rows one through four. The P300 in this example, as in previous, is going to provide for hybrid learning. And we can of course swap out components as needed. So if we wanted to go with the MXA 710 linear array, we could of course do that. And if we wanted to use a room PC and Intellimix room audio processing software, we can absolutely do that as well. AVISPL is gonna use Sure's designer software to configure and fine tune all of the settings. And of course you can monitor and manage this with system on after the installation. And perhaps this space is reconfigurable, right? Maybe we change the desks and the seats and the people move to different locations. In this case, our microphone arrays stay in the exact same spot. And essentially we just load a different preset for that seating layout. The MXA 910 is extremely flexible and will provide identical quality in this example, just as it did in the previous example. So very, very consistent. And of course, like we discussed in the last application, we can use a linear array or we can use the P300 or Intellimix room in place of that P300. So very, very flexible, scalable solution. And touch-free again, and socially distanced, that's the main theme here, right? So we've got here a standard classroom and maybe some of the seats are going to be blocked off to allow for more distancing between students. In this example, we've got a couple of MXA 710 linear array microphones in the ceiling. And with that steerable coverage, we're able to obtain consistent even coverage regardless of where a student is seated. So regardless if they're in the front row or the back row, they will be picked up um, just the same. We have the P300 for hybrid learning in this example. And again, we're using the MXN 5C for the remote participants. Of course, this can scale up to a larger classroom. Again, we maybe need to accommodate more physical space between students. We can do that by adding additional microphones. You'll see we added an MX, uh, MXA 710 and a couple of speakers. So in this case, again, we have consistent audio coverage in the space for the students that are seated in the front row all the way to that last row. And again, P300s and MXN 5C for hybrid learning in this particular space. Now let's take a look at how we can adjust system components to allow for touch-free and social distancing in the classroom. So in this particular example, you know, we've got a top-down view of the lecture hall on the upper right-hand side, and we're going to give that professor a wireless body pack with an ear set or a headset microphone, and we want to reinforce his or her audio into the classroom. So we've got a couple of point source speakers at the front of the room, and we're going to route that audio into the classroom. So a simple voice reinforcement solution. And while this is a great solution, it's not necessarily touch-free, right? So if we wanna move this on to a touch-free solution, we could instead go to the MXA 910s. And this is again gonna provide our invisible audio coverage without the need for anyone to interact with the technology. Other benefits include, of course, that the professor can move freely about the front of the room and there's no need for microphone technique. There's no need to worry about rechargeable batteries. It's a very seamless touch-free audio. Now, if we want to reinforce their audio back to the classroom, again, we can use those point source speakers. And if we wanna to go to a fully hybrid learning environment in which teachers and students can interact remotely with other participants, we can add two additional MXA 910s in this lecture hall. So you'll see we've got a total of five there and you'll see we've got lobes covering that entire classroom, that entire lecture hall. So we've got 
touch-free consistent coverage, really regardless of where a student is seated. And that helps maintain social distancing. Now, if we need to reinforce audio in the classroom with all of those um, MXA 910s mounted, the challenge is picking up the teacher, for example, and sending that audio out through the speakers at the front of the room. Unfortunately, the result here would be some feedback. So instead, what we wanna do is we want to provide what's called a zoned speaker system. And what we will use instead is voice lift. So in this example, we could use a series of network speakers such as the MXN 5C. And I think it's important to differentiate voice lift from sound reinforcement. So the previous example we discussed was a sound reinforcement application. So essentially we're going to amplify that sound, which is a voice to levels so that it can be heard at a distance and in noisy environments. Voice lift by contrast is intended to just restore the natural speech level from a talker to that farthest listener in the classroom. This does require careful planning to ensure that there's no feedback and that all of the audio is routed to the proper place. And the team at AVISPL are extremely knowledgeable on this topic. So what you'll see on the screen here is we've got those three front MXA 910s picking up the teacher. And you'll see those little purple dots. Those are MXN 5Cs. And you'll see that heat map coverage, which essentially is telling us our volume level. So of course, the farther away we go, that student that's in that last row needs a little bit more volume to hear that teacher just as well as the student in the front row. And this system is designed to accommodate that. So if a student in the last row had a question, we would use a lobe from the MXA 910 that's near them. We'll pick up that question. And again, we're gonna route that audio to the individuals that are farther away at a higher volume level than those who are closest. The gentleman that's seated right next to him doesn't need reinforcement because they can hear them clearly. And this works throughout the classroom. So of course, if someone on the up opposite side had a question, we would use that same system. So of course it does require proper planning and setup. And again, the AVSPL team is extremely knowledgeable and can implement this solution successfully. The benefit here, we can use this for high quality, touch-free audio, supporting social distancing and allowing for full hybrid learning in this environment. And with that, I'm going to move to the last section, which is how we can implement technology in spaces that maybe don't have dedicated AV infrastructure. And of course, we're going to talk a little bit about the SHIRT ecosystem. So as we've seen in previous examples, it's an extremely flexible and scalable solution. So we can accommodate small offices, small spaces, all the way up to larger spaces. And we're always going to have that consistent high quality audio. So maybe in this example, we're going to use the ecosystem and maybe we need to provide audio to a space that has no dedicated AV infrastructure. We're gonna wheel that in on a mobile cart. So in this example, of course, the cart is outfitted with a display and a camera. We also have a PoE switch and a soft codec PC on that particular cart. We've added the MXA 710. And again, with the steerable coverage, we can pick up everyone in that classroom. And within Telemix room, we're able to interact with the far end. So we're able to do our full hybrid learning in this particular example. The far end audio can be routed via Intellimix room to the speakers on the display. So really powerful, portable solution that can bring in high quality audio where it's needed. Maybe it's a library study space, or maybe it's a huddle room that doesn't have you know, AV infrastructure. Very similar to some of the examples we've seen, we're using the MXA 310 to provide coverage to pick up everybody around that, that conference table or that library table. And we're able to provide hybrid learning with the Intellimix room that's installed on our soft codec PC. And the MXN 5C is going to provide that high quality speech reproduction back into that library study or huddle room environment. And before we talk about the last example, I'd like to introduce you to MXCW. This is a wireless discussion system. It's extremely portable, very, very flexible solution for collaboration and discussion. The base station that you see in that picture actually features a gooseneck and an integrated loudspeaker, truly eliminating the need for external sound reinforcement systems. Of course, the key features are simplicity of use, self-managed RF, extended runtime, ability to integrate with other input and output devices, 
And let's take a look at how this can come together. So maybe you're using or you need a system for a gym or a cafeteria. It's just space that really doesn't have any AV and it, it may never. So in this example, we've brought in MXCW. You'll see the MXCW APT, which is the access point that's mounted on the wall. That's the main brain or heart of the system that's gonna do all of the coordination of the wireless frequencies. Now at each of those desks, we have an MXCW640 base station. Again, we have a gooseneck microphone. So anybody that speaks will be reinforced through the speakers of all of the other devices in that room. So really eliminates the need for any additional equipment in the space and allows us to bring in portable high quality audio and maintain social distancing. And with that, I hope that that was a helpful overview of our high quality audio solutions for educational facilities. Again, the Sure solution is gonna offer flexibility and scalability for your smaller classrooms all the way up to your larger lecture halls. And it's gonna provide that high quality consistent audio for hybrid learning, modified classroom learning and learning in those non-traditional spaces. So what's next? At this point, we invite you to take out your mobile device and scan the QR codes in front of you. You can learn more about our solutions on our website and you can also sign up for our newsletter. And with that, I thank you for your time. I thank AVISPL for the opportunity and we will open up the line to see if there's any questions. Thank you, Vanessa. There's a question that came in, it says, I'm interested if you could provide me information, non-NDA, of course, about Shure's roadmap with Zoom rooms, specifically the ability for ZR to monitor lobes of an MXA and direct a preset capable camera or achieve or speaker tracking experience. I'm well aware of a one beyond, but their solution is a little pricey. I know this may require just a little bit of research, but I wanted to see if you guys had any ideas uh, from this question that came in from Mark. Yeah, thanks, Jay. Thanks, Mark. That's a great question. Um, we are, uh, we do work closely with soft codec providers such as Zoom. Um, I don't have any specific information on that at this particular time, but I will certainly research that and see if I can provide back an answer. Um, I am aware of the One Beyond system as well. Um, it's a great solution. Um, and I will, like I said, I'll have to check into that and we'll get back to you on it. Excellent. Very good. Any other questions that may come in today for while well, you've got the experts right here at your fingertips? Very good. All right. Well, I want to thank Vanessa and Stephanie for um, their wonderful presentation today. Uh, Vanessa, if you wouldn't mind, if you wouldn't mind taking down content, and I'm going to share content about the next event that we have, and I think everybody- hey Jay, right before you do that, it looks like we had one more question come in. Oh, um, good, go ahead. Question about wireless mics. Is there any wireless mics to hook straight into a laptop or PC for uh, physical ed teachers? Hmm, that is a good one. So um, you would need additional equipment connected to the receiver um, to go into like a USB, for example. And that's a solution that AVISPL can help with. And of course we have more information about that on our website as well. But great, great question and great application. Perfect. Thank you, Rihanna. All right, the next event that is coming up is the raffle prize that everybody is probably very excited about. I'm sharing the screen now, and what I'm gonna invite everyone to do is in the next couple of minutes is to go back into the lobby. Um, and as you kind of scroll around, where you are right now is in the par partner spotlight. Just turn around in the virtual environment and come back to the AVISPL booth and then you'll notice right through here is the live drawing for the raffle. Just click on that. This is also a Zoom link and it will be available uh, for everybody to watch the live drawing here in just a little bit. And Vanessa, I believe if I remember correctly, Sure is donating one of those uh, microphones that uh, has the, it's the brand new one that has the kind of the ball shape at the end of it. Is that correct? 
That's correct. Yeah, that MV5C. So good luck to Excellent. everybody. Yeah. Yeah, exciting. Very good. All right, I'll go ahead and take this down. Any other questions that came in uh, from the chat window, Brianna? No, we are good to go. All right, sounds good. And we thank everybody. We'll uh, see everybody over at the raffle here in just a moment. Thanks again. Have a good day.